but let me get Neeta at this point. Uh, Neeta, you have been giving us very important information on how this was no ordinary person. He was bringing, building a private militia, operating out of drug rehabilitation centers, bringing in arms from Punjab via ISI. Neeta, the government has gone ahead and booked him under NSA, but the fact remains, is he in India? And we are still circling around Punjab, Haryana. See, see that's a million dollar uh, question, Sneha. You know, I would say it is the callousness of both the state and central authorities that they have not been able to catch a man who seems to be on the run. And so coordinated are his efforts that from he moves from a place A to a place B where everything is sorted out for him, whether it's a car, whether whether it's change of clothes, whether it's his food or shelter, you know, so something must be going right for him. Something might be working for him. That needs to be questioned. And obviously now the government, you know, is coming out with more and more details because questions were being raised by political parties that why most of his associates and Amrit Pal himself has been booked under NSA. So now the government has justified. They categorically say they that he needed to be, uh, uh, you know, booked under NSA because uh, otherwise he would have created law and order problem and links with proscribed outfit six for justice are now clearly being spelled out in the investigations. They are coming to uh, light. In fact, the de-addiction centers and the private militia has clear markings of ISI, how the weapons, the drugs was being supplied by Pakistan ISI, how drones were dropping caseloads. In fact, you know, interestingly, they are also saying that why these uh, associates, why his associates were moved out of uh, Punjab and moved to Dibrugar. Again, they are saying that they would have run their criminal activities within jail. So that just shows how, you know, how lost the entire establishment is that they feel that if one arrested or his WPD associates arrested, they would have run a racket from inside the jail or they would have indulged in jailbreak. So these are the kind of apprehensions they already have even when, then, um, when Amrit Pal is not in their hands. So right now also they are going through and interestingly Sneha, you know, the kind of money laundering activities, his uh, money laundering activities which have now come to light, that misappropriation of fund not only by Amritpal but his family also. The intelligence agencies and the Punjab police have collected lots of information which indicates that he gave no account of the collections during various programs in the name of religion like Khalsa Wahir and Amrit Pan. In fact, his entire family was misusing funds, accused the local police. Amrit Pal himself, his uncle Harjit Singh and brother Harpreet Singh were also involved. In fact, they go further to say that earlier treasurer Basant Singh Dalatpura, who had known Pakistani linkages and in his, uh, his, uh, he was also spending out money. So obviously whole plethora of information is coming. But the main fact is that Amrit right. Pal himself is missing. Interestingly, now LOC has been issued by LOC, you know, at both uh, the border security force and also SSB. One guards the Pan uh, Pakistan border, right. the other guards the Nepal border. So LOC has been issued. If they can't find him inside, they have to look him, look, look at, look for him around the border areas also. Sneha?